Singapore, a city-state that is a vibrant tapestry of cultures, traditions, and most importantly, flavors. A melting pot of cultures and cuisines. Here, food is not just sustenance, it is a way of life, a celebration of diversity, and a testament to the island's rich heritage. Among the many culinary delights this island nation offers, durian holds a special place. Known for its strong odor and unique taste, it is a fruit that evokes strong reactions. Its pungent aroma and creamy texture have earned it the title King of Fruits. For some, it is an acquired taste, while for others, it is an instant favorite. Come mid-autumn festival, durian takes on a new form mooncakes. This festival, celebrated by many in Singapore, is a time for family reunions and enjoying traditional foods. These sweet treats, traditionally filled with lotus seed paste and salted egg yolk, are now infused with the unmistakable flavor of durian. The result is a mooncake that is both familiar and exotic. The combination is, to put it mildly, divisive. Some find the blend of sweet and savory with the durian's distinct taste to be a match made in heaven. You either love it or hate it. This polarizing nature of durian mooncakes makes them a topic of lively debate among food enthusiasts. Among the many purveyors of this unique delicacy is Four Seasons Durian. They are known for their premium durian products, including their popular Mini D24 mooncakes. Their dedication to quality has earned them a loyal following. However, recently, this beloved brand found itself at the center of a food safety issue that sent ripples of concern through Singapore. The incident has raised questions about food safety standards and the measures in place to protect consumers. Authorities have stepped in to investigate, ensuring that all necessary steps are taken to address the issue and restore public confidence. The incident serves as a reminder of the importance of stringent food safety practices. Despite the setback, the love for durian and its many forms, including the controversial mooncake, remains strong. Singaporeans continue to celebrate their culinary heritage, embracing both the traditional and the innovative. In the end, food in Singapore is more than just a meal. It is a reflection of the nation's spirit, resilience, and unity. Whether you are a fan of durian or not, there is no denying its place in the heart of Singapore's culinary landscape. On date of recall, the Singapore Food Agency, SFA, issued a recall for Four Seasons Durian's Mini D24 Mooncakes. The culprit? Excessive levels of Bacillus cereus. This bacterium, commonly found in soil and food, can cause food poisoning if allowed to multiply to unsafe levels. It was a stark reminder that even the most tempting treats can harbor hidden dangers. The recall was immediate and comprehensive. All affected batches of the Mini D24 mooncakes were pulled from the shelves. Consumers were urged to return any purchased mooncakes for a full refund. It was a swift and decisive response to a serious health risk. Bacillus cereus is a bacterium that is commonly found in the environment. It is a microscopic organism that can be both fascinating and dangerous. It is present in soil, dust, and even in raw foods like rice, vegetables, and spices. These everyday items can harbor this tiny troublemaker without us even realizing it. While not all strains are harmful, some can produce toxins that cause food poisoning. These toxins can lead to symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea, which can be quite severe in some cases. These toxins are often heat-stable, meaning they can survive even after cooking. This resilience makes Bacillus cereus particularly challenging to deal with in the kitchen. This makes Bacillus cereus a particularly persistent threat to food safety. It can contaminate a wide range of foods, and its ability to withstand heat means that even cooked foods are not always safe. When food contaminated with Bacillus cereus is left at room temperature, the bacteria multiply rapidly, Within a few hours, the number of bacteria can increase dramatically, making the food highly unsafe to eat. They release toxins into the food, making it unsafe for consumption. These toxins are the primary cause of the food poisoning symptoms associated with Bacillus cereus. This is why proper food handling and storage are crucial in preventing Bacillus cereus food poisoning. Keeping food at the right temperature, cooking it thoroughly, and storing it properly can significantly reduce the risk. Simple practices like washing hands, cleaning kitchen surfaces, and avoiding cross-contamination can go a long way in keeping this tiny troublemaker at bay. By being vigilant and following food safety guidelines, we can protect ourselves and our loved ones from the harmful effects of Bacillus cereus. Ultimately, 
Understanding the risks and taking preventive measures ensures that we can enjoy our meals without worry. Bacillus cereus may be a tiny troublemaker, but with the right precautions, we can keep it under control and maintain a safe and healthy kitchen environment. The symptoms of Bacillus cereus food poisoning are often unpleasant, but thankfully, usually mild and short-lived. They typically appear within 30 minutes to 15 hours after consuming contaminated food. The most common symptoms are nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. In most cases, the symptoms resolve themselves within 24 hours. However, in some instances, particularly in young children, the elderly, or individuals with weakened immune systems, Bacillus serious food poisoning can lead to more severe complications. Section 5. How does Bacillus serious thrive? Bacillus serious thrives in warm, moist environments. This makes cooked food, especially starchy foods like rice and pasta, particularly susceptible to contamination. When these foods are left at room temperature for extended periods, Bacillus serious can multiply rapidly, increasing the risk of food poisoning. It's essential to remember that Bacillus cereus can survive even after cooking. This means that even if food is heated thoroughly, if it's not stored properly afterwards, it can still become contaminated. Section 6. Preventing Bacillus cereus Growth The good news is that preventing Bacillus cereus growth is relatively straightforward. By following a few essential food safety practices, you can keep this harmful bacterium at bay and ensure the food you prepare is safe for consumption. The key is to practice proper food hygiene and storage. This means maintaining cleanliness in your kitchen, washing your hands regularly, and ensuring that all surfaces and utensils are sanitized. This includes cooking food thoroughly. Cooking food to the right temperature is crucial. Ensure that food, especially rice and other starchy foods, is cooked to the recommended internal temperature. Bacillus cereus spores can survive in undercooked food, so using a food thermometer to check internal temperatures is a good practice. Cooling food quickly. Refrigerate leftovers within two hours of cooking. This helps to prevent the bacteria from multiplying. Storing food properly. Keep hot foods hot and cold foods cold. Use a refrigerator to store perishable items and ensure that your fridge is set to the correct temperature, ideally below 40 degrees Fahrenheit, 4 degrees Celsius. Reheating food thoroughly. When reheating leftovers, make sure they are steaming hot all the way through. This means heating the food to at least 165 degrees Fahrenheit, 74 degrees Celsius, to kill any bacteria that may have grown during storage. Following these simple steps can significantly reduce the risk of Bacillus cereus contamination and ensure that your food remains safe to eat. By being diligent and mindful of food safety practices, you can protect yourself and your loved ones from foodborne illnesses. Remember, a little extra care in the kitchen goes a long way in keeping everyone healthy and happy. Section 7 Mooncake Safety, A Consumer's Guide The Recent Recall of Four Seasons Durian's Mooncakes serves as a timely reminder of the importance of food safety, especially during festive seasons when food gifts are common. While the SFA works tirelessly to ensure food safety standards are met, consumers play a crucial role in protecting themselves. When purchasing mooncakes, always buy from reputable retailers, check the packaging for any signs of damage, and pay attention to the expiration date. If something seems amiss, it's best to err on the side of caution and not consume the product. Section 8. Look for the signs. Identifying spoiled mooncakes. Mooncakes, with their rich fillings and often extended shelf life, can be breeding grounds for bacteria if not stored properly. It's essential to be able to identify signs of spoilage to prevent food poisoning. Look out for any changes in appearance, such as mold growth, discoloration, or an unusual texture. Additionally, any off-putting smell should be a red flag. If you notice any of these signs, discard the mooncake immediately. Section 9. Beyond the Recall, Food Safety in Perspective The recall of Four Seasons Durian's Mooncakes, while concerning, highlights the effectiveness of food safety regulations. The SFA's swift action in recalling the affected products and informing the public demonstrates the importance of a robust food safety system. Such incidents serve as a reminder that food safety is a shared responsibility. Consumers, manufacturers, and regulatory bodies all play a crucial role in ensuring the food we consume is safe. Section 10. The Importance of Vigilance 
While food safety regulations are in place to protect consumers, vigilance is key. Consumers should stay informed about food recalls and follow food safety guidelines. Simple actions like washing your hands before handling food, storing food properly, and checking for signs of spoilage can go a long way in preventing food poisoning. Section 11. Conclusion. Enjoying Mooncakes Safely. The Mid-Autumn Festival is a time for celebration, family, and of course, mooncakes. While the recent recall may have cast a temporary shadow over this beloved treat, it serves as a timely reminder of the importance of food safety. By staying informed, being vigilant, and following simple food safety guidelines, we can all continue to enjoy the delicious tradition of mooncakes without compromising our health.